Barnsley secured their second Skybet Championship win of the season as they comfortably beat Sunderland 3-2-0 at Oakwell. A Nykugba goal and strikes from Harvey Barnes and George Monka were the least Barnsley deserved in a convincing win over a lacklustre visiting side. Sunderland were very nearly given a fortuitous start to the game in the fourth minute when George Honeyman and Lewis Graben found themselves to 1-1 against Adam Jackson. Honeyman's cross was almost diverted into his own net by Jackson. Brad Potts went close for Barnsley in the 12th minute when Lamine Cohn failed to shepherd the ball out of the play, but his effort was well wide of the goal. Barnsley continued to press and missed a fine chance in the 30th minute when Adam Hamill cut inside from the right to deliver a perfect cross for Potts, but his header lacked any power and was easy for Robin Rooter to save. The opening goal came shortly after in the 31st minute, with Rooter unable to get any distance on his parry from Barnes' effort on the left side. Chelsea Loney Ugbo was the first to react to the loose ball to bundle the ball into the Sunderland net. It was 2-2-0 in the 35th minute when Barnes got on the end of a poor clearance from Cohn and his volley rocketed into the net to a rapturous ovation from the Oakwell faithful. Sunderland were unlucky not to have a man advantage when James Vaughan was clattered in the 43rd minute by Liam Lindsay, with Vaughan one-on-one with goalkeeper Adam Davis. Referee Chris Kavanagh let the defender off with a booking. Barnes could have made it three in the 60th minute when he got on the end of a deep cross from Hamill from the right side. The header from Barnes was a difficult one at a tight angle and his effort went over the bar. The Tykes sealed the three points in the 67th minute with a counter-attack. Ugbo picked the perfect moment to slide in Monka on the left side of the box and he finished into the near post. It nearly got worse for Sunderland when substitute Wabi Kazri tried a flick in his own half, only to be robbed by Jason McCarthy who had charged towards goal before firing a shot wide. Sunderland offered little of any quality or effort in the second half with Barnsley comfortably allowed to see out the rest of the game and claim a much needed victory. Barnsley boss Paul Hecking bottom, I'm very happy and I'm pleased for the players because they've deserved it. I think it's been coming, to be honest. It gives them confidence. We have to play to our strengths and try and hide our weaknesses and I think we did that today. Sunderland boss Simon Grayson, they deserve to win the game because they did the basics right. They ran further and harder, they made tackles and that's what the championship is about. It's never acceptable to lose a game and it's certainly not acceptable to lose a game in the manner that we did.